find the square of 91 using 10 to the power n method. So 91 can also be written as 100 minus 9. So it is close to 100 minus 9 or 10 to the power 2. So we saw earlier that something like this can be solved using the equation b plus 2x stroke x square. Right? So what is the base here? Base is 100 plus 2 into x. Now what is the value of x? x is basically the surplus or the deficit. Here you have a deficit of 9 so you write minus 9 stroke minus 9 whole square. x is equal to the deficit. So 100 plus 2 into minus 9 can be written as 100 minus 18 or 82. 9 square can be written as what? 81. So 82 is there with a base of 100 into 100 gives you 8200. Add this 81 to it. 8281. So this is your answer. So 91 square is equal to 8281. Right? Let's try the traditional method also. So you had basically 91, okay? So what was the deficit? 191 minus 100. Let's take the base as 100. 91 minus 100 gives you minus 9. You find out the square of minus 9. Square of minus 9 gives you 81. That's a positive number. You add 91 plus minus 9. That gives you 82. Since the base is 100, so you multiply it by base, which is 100, you get 8200. You add 81 to it, 8281. Again, the same answer. So you can use either of these methods to find the square of a number which can be expressed in the form of 10 to the power n.